Peggy 16. In a world where you rescue heroes from other timelines and brawl worm gods with your bare hands, it's a battle of light versus dark, monsters versus metal, everyone versus Telesto, in a lore-rich universe with an abundance of adventure and exploring. But that's not just why we play, is it? Believe me, nightmare hunts give me quite the adrenaline rush, but my Twitter mention suggests you expect more. So did you keep playing for the life-changing god rolls? Or the mile high sparrow flying? The Nessus frogs? The day one raid nights with your friends where you spend 8 hours and still don't know what you're doing? The Nessus frogs? You must have had some inspiration, right? Probably the creators and streamers that helped you forget that time you dropped your pizza, cheese side down. Or was it the people creating a destiny universe of their own with stories, art, and literally dressing for the job they want? Maybe you're here for the intellectual discussion, or maybe you're here for the space sports. Maybe you're here for the destiny creators you love so much, Bungie actually got one to do this video. Hi, mom and dad. What I'm trying to say is, Destiny 2 is so much more than the game we see in trailers. While many joined for the fantasy, we found a home amongst its people. And in the end game, we stayed for the discos, the DPS, the grenades, the bad bubbles, burgers, and tannics behind every corner. Trombone medleys, laser tag, tower names, yeehaws, the dings, the funs, the clutcher kicks, sweeper bots, stasis crystals, cheese spots, raid callouts, pub song, ramen, sliding, chicken petting, galahorn, sepix prime, shiny swords, titan.